Hi, Russell Crumbly with the law firm of Crumbly Blackwell Wisda and Associates. Uh, questions about driver's license suspensions pursuant to a DUI arrest are very frequent. Uh, I've got some documents here that I'm going to show you uh, that will help answer some questions you will have initially. And these are documents that should be given to you in addition to the ticket which cites you with DUI. Um, and these are relative to your driver's license suspension. The officer who arrests you is supposed to take your driver's license and give you a form called the AST60. And this is that form. This is the front side. This is the back side. Now I've got two documents, but if you get one, it's going to be one document and it will have writing on the front and back. I've highlighted some items here. This at the top is really, really important for your lawyer. Make sure you save this document. It is your temporary driver's license and the police officer should tell you. I highlighted an area down here towards the bottom, which is really important for you. It tells you that your license will be suspended 45 days after the date of your arrest, which means if you got arrested last night and you're checking out this video, you still have 44 days more that your license is valid and you are legally able to drive. This is temporary driver's license. Save this document and bring it when you meet with your lawyer. On the back side, <clears throat> um, up towards the top, it talks about requesting an administrative review for your suspension. Here in the middle, it talks about uh, requesting an administrative hearing. And down towards the bottom, it tells you what the issues would be at that hearing. Um, the hearing's got to be requested within 10 days of your arrest. The administrative review can be requested anytime within 90 days. Um, it is important that you make at least one of these requests because we can, if the Alabama Department of Public Safety suspends your driver's license, we can actually get that back and stop that suspension, but only if you've exhausted your administrative remedies, which is a, a legal requirement, and you can do that in either of these two ways. Um, if you come see us, uh, bring these documents. We can get the appropriate request made for you. We can go with you to the hearing if you request that. We can take the care of the administrative review if you are outside of the 10 days. Uh, and this lays the groundwork for us to be able to get your driver's license back. The certificate of alcohol analysis is also really important. Bring that with us. You should get a copy of that upon your release from jail. Bring these documents with us. Uh, very, very useful information. We can help you get your license back and we can help give you an idea of what we can do for you if you bring these documents along with your uh, ticket for DUI. Hope this is helpful. Relax. Have a good day.